6, a woman who heard a strange noise may have been a lifesaver for her neighbors. She went on a mission and did not stop until they were all safe. 7 Action News reporter Tara Edwards with her story. Susan Bowditch was sleepless Sunday morning when she heard crackling coming from the ceiling in her home at the Park Place Apartments in Madison Heights. I was determined to find where this source is coming from. She discovered the roof was on fire and quickly got her seven-year-old out with just the clothes on their backs. Next, the spunky single mom went back inside for everyone else in the eight units in the building. I banged until they answered the door. We could hear people stir and we just banged. So you're pretty determined. I was determined. I was determined that I was going to do whatever I could. Once firefighters got to the scene, everyone made it out safely. Sue and her daughter lost everything in the fire. Not sure how much time she had before the roof eventually collapsed. She never thought for a second about getting any of her valuables. Never crossed my mind. It was my daughter, first and foremost, and then other people, because I didn't know where it was coming from. I knew a roof was on fire. I didn't know how fast it would spread. People matter, and that's, that's what it's about. It really is. Since then, she says she's received donations for her and her daughter, Shyla. She's seven. She doesn't understand the big picture. She understands her toys are gone, her Christmas is gone, her, her little world is disrupted, and everything is gone. But the biggest gift, their lives were saved. And Sue doesn't think of her brave actions as heroic. She says God put her there for a reason. And a GoFundMe account has been set up by a friend to help Susan get back on her feet and replace some of those Christmas presents for her daughter. We have that information on our website at WXYZ.com. In Madison Heights, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News.